What's up folks, I'm Green Beef, and we're going to walk through exploring derelicts in Space Haven. We're going to cover the following topics. Derelict identification, pre-mission preparation, and mission execution. Space Haven has two types of derelicts, claimable and unclaimable. These are identifiable by the following icons on the system map and sector maps. Claimable derelicts can be added to your fleet after exploring them and clearing them of threats. Unclaimable are the opposite, but can have resources or crew members for you to rescue. Before executing an away mission, you must perform some reconnaissance. Let's look at the exterior of the ship and look for points of entry and plan our breach. Airlocks and hull breaches provide a docking point for your shuttle and entry for your away team. Now that we've identified our target, prepare an away team for exploring the derelict likely filled with hostiles. To do this, we're going to select a team, arm them, and board the derelict. Select one to four crew members with higher weapon skills. With more than one shuttle, you can bring five to eight away team members, but it's likely not needed. Likely. Keep some crew in reserve on your ship in case that likely not turns into a likely. While your crew members should always be armed to repel boarders, we'll walk through it real quick. Draft your first crew member by selecting them and clicking the draft button here. Right click on the storage and click on the grabbing a hand icon and drag either a pistol or a shotgun to the primary slot. Let's talk about the firearms currently available. Pistols fire a single round with low accuracy and low damage. Shotguns fire multiple rounds in a spread with high damage at close range. SMGs or submachine guns fire multiple rounds in a burst with moderate damage at medium range. Assault rifles fire a single round with moderate damage at long range. Keep this in mind when arming your team. Keep the away team drafted. Select them all, right click on your shuttle, and click the enter icon. Once the away team is on board the shuttle, select the shuttle, click the dock button, and if the derelict has an airlock, click it and click accept. If it doesn't have an airlock, Click a square near a hull breach and click accept. Exploration involves hazards for your crew members and by default, you should treat the derelict as a hostile environment. Left click and drag a box over your crew members or select them in the crew icons on top of the screen. Right click on an unexplored section of the ship to move your crew members. Hold shift and right click multiple times to set move waypoints. Monitor your crew members vital signs, prioritizing oxygen and stamina. Oxygen is refilled at the airlock or shuttle, while stamina must be recovered on your ship or by taking a seat on some furniture on the derelict. If either of these bars are empty, the crew member will fall unconscious. Currently, your biggest threat on derelicts are aliens, and they come in two flavors, the crawler and the hauler. This quadruped slowly crawls around on the floor using a biting attack and cannot move in open space. Engage these hostiles from afar with pistols and assault rifles and up close with SMGs and shotguns. The Hauler, this large tentacled alien, floats through space and has a charging attack to close the distance and knock your crew members back, then engaging them in melee combat with its arms. Engage this alien with caution and aim to engage it in close quarters with shotguns or SMGs, avoiding its devastating charge attack. Presence of Haulers on derelicts indicates you have a much bigger problem. Crawlers and haulers aim to incapacitate your crew members and bring them back to their hive. If incapacitated, your crew member will be cocooned by a hauler alien and carried back to their hive and plastered to the wall while providing them with oxygen. You may encounter other factions crew cocooned on ships, and they may be freed by right-clicking on them and clicking the gear icon to free them. This hive also has an egg layer that spawns crawler and hauler eggs within the hive creep. Once discovered, destroying these eggs is a priority to avoid ship repopulation. If you encounter an item with the grabbing hand icon over it, your crew member can loot it. These include currency and data logs. If you're lucky enough to stumble onto one of these hypersleep chambers, interact with it. A crew member from the derelict will exit it and you will either gain a new crew member for your ship or they will die immediately. It's a roll of the dice. We'll cover what to do with this secured derelict in another video. 
but reboard the shuttle and fly back to your ship, or simply undraft your crew and shuttle to allow them to navigate on their own. I hope this has clarified some facets of derelicts and their exploration, and if you have questions, throw them in the comments down below, or hop on the developer's discord, linked in the description below. Thanks for joining me folks, and good luck in your exploration. Take it easy.